bonkers, you nutty kitty. I'll be right home. Keep my bed warm, okay? Hey, keep your paws to yourself. She's my girlfriend. So what was your favorite part of the movie? Uh, my favorite part of the movie is when we made out. Yeah. <laughs> Movies are fun. Yeah. Good night. You know, it's amazing how you always manage to pull the car right up to the garage, but not actually into it. <laughs> yep. Takes a keen eye and a sure foot. How would you like your keen eye to watch my sure foot kick your smart ass? Why don't I pull the car in? What the? You're moving at a foot and you hit something. Oh, God, no, it's... It's Mr. Bonkers. Wow, that is one dead cat. So you didn't tell her? I felt so guilty. I just... I couldn't. Is it because you're kind of glad it's dead? No. Hey, maybe I don't have to tell her. Maybe she'll just think Mr. Bonkers ran away. That works. That's what we told you when, um... Shh. Pizza rolls. Oh, come on, how hard can this be? You go over there and you say, hey, I'm a cat killer. I'm mur <laughs> I murdered your cat. <laughs> but you try to say it with a straight face. <laughs> what? Am I the only one that sees the humor in this? I think you might be, Red. Come on, that thing was always messing in my yard, going through our garbage. Now we have Hyde for that. <laughs> oh, yeah, Lorraine, what exactly do you do? Oh, that's right, the Packers. <laughs> Excuse me, dilemma here? Eric, this is not a dilemma. You have to tell Donna. Just be gentle and, and maybe take her a nice little gift. Yeah, like a kitty-sized headstone. <laughs> I should have known you were lying. Sure, Flipper was fast, but turtles don't just run away. <laughs> hey, beautiful. How's it going? Oh, pretty good. Except I found this here kitten who told me he was looking for someone to oh, love him. Oh my god! Oh, he's so cute. Thank you, Eric. That's so sweet. Oh, I hope Mr. Bonkers doesn't get jealous. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's going to happen, Donna, because I accidentally killed Mr. Bonkers. So, where are you going to name this little fella here? What? What are you talking about? I've had a cat since I was three. What happened? Well, last night I was pulling in the car after our date. After our date? Last night? Eric, I was looking for him and I asked you. And you said you hadn't seen him. And you knew I was worried sick about him. I know, Donna. That's why it was so hard to tell you. Hey there. Oh there. Hi there. <laughs> What's going on? Why don't you ask the man who murdered our cat? No. No, that's... No, I didn't murder your cat. It was... He climbed under my car. It was a total accident. Well, I should hope so, because what did he ever do to you? Hey there, Mitch. Kitty, uh, insisted I bring this over to show our sorrow because of your loss. Oh, thanks, Red. We were all sitting around reminiscing about our dear departed cat, Mr. Bonkers J. Pinciati. Do you have a story you want to share, Red? <clears throat> We'd sure appreciate it, seeing as how your son killed him. 
Okay. Well, I remember he used to come into my yard and, uh, and, uh, you know, I'd throw a bucket at him or <laughs> spray him with a hose. Then he'd run away. Then he'd come back. I'd do it again. <laughs> I guess you, you could say we kind of had our own thing. <laughs> wow. <clears throat> well, <clears throat> okay, <clears throat> enjoy the casserole. We set up a Mr. Bonkers memorial slideshow in the other room. So. Uh-huh. Uh, <clears throat> that casserole there is a seven layer. Of course, uh, two of those layers are peas, and I really should have told you right away about your cat, but it's a pretty good casserole. There's ham in it. <laughs> Look, Eric, I know you don't want to hurt me, and I understand that. It's just... We've got to be honest with each other. I mean, especially now that we've, you know, we've, you know, because I just don't want to end up like Jackie and Kelso. No, no, I don't think we're going to end up like Jackie and Kelso. I mean, I lied out of the goodness of my heart. It's still a lie, Eric. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry, Donna about everything. <laughs> All right, well, from now on, no more secrets. Oh, God, then I guess I have to come clean. Okay, in first grade, behind your back, I used to call you Donna Pinch My Butty. <laughs> <clears throat> well, you know, Eric, that's okay, because I was the first one to call you Eric Foreskin. <laughs> started that? Oh, that's not funny. That one's stuck. Shut up, foreskin. 